Hi, it's Lucy from Catching Rainbows Fertility and today talking about one of the unsung heroes of fertility care that makes a massive difference to implantation, periods, well-being and it's castor oil packs. So castor oil is a really ancient form of healing. Um, it's a very thick kind of oil and it's basically, uh, it's got a very high fat content to it. So what it does is when you soak a little cloth and you apply it to the uterus or to the liver and you apply heat for some time, then you are gonna improve lots of circulation and boost the lymphatic system and it will draw, through the osmosis, it will draw out any toxins and really help your uterus to be well, to be healthy and just to be emptying well during each cycle. So castor oil packs are recommended for women who either have endometriosis, have any scarring or adhesions, who've had any previous surgery, who have got heavy periods, painful periods, clotty periods, or periods where there's a lot of brown, dark blood, either at the beginning of the cycle or right at the end of the cycle. So what you have to do, if you'd like to have a go at castor oil packs, is just be aware of when in your cycle you're going to do this. So never when you're actually bleeding and never if you, there's a chance that you think you could be pregnant. So if you're getting things ready for IVF, you can do it all the way up until embryo transfer if you're doing a frozen, frozen cycle or if you're doing a fresh cycle, just do it up until you begin to stimulate. And if you are kind of just getting everything fixed in order to get pregnant, then do it throughout your cycle other than when you're bleeding. But if you're somebody who thinks, well, every month, you know, there's definitely a chance that I could be pregnant, then then just do it in the week between period and ovulation. So all you're going to do is get your castor oil. Uh, you can either buy, this is a roll on one, so you can put it straight on your skin, or you can buy a big bottle of it from either a health food shop or from Amazon or from even some supermarkets do it. So it's organic castor oil and if you can get it cold pressed is best. And then you need a little cloth. You can either use a dishcloth, you can use a little flannel, you can use a bit of kitchen roll, anything really, but something that you don't mind the fact that it'll probably get a bit wrecked because this oil is not good to get on clothes or anything that you want to keep. So what you do is get your castor oil and pour it in a little pot, soak your cloth inside it, and then place the cloth on your uterus. So really right, we're talking right below Nicoline. And lie down and relax, put a hot water bottle over the top and just sit with that for about 15, 20 minutes. And you're gonna do that for three nights in a row. Or if you've got a particularly bad situation with your periods, you can do it five nights in a row, or you can do it every other day. So this is every other day, or three to five nights a week, other than when you've got your period. So it does feel like a bit of an investment in time, but if you do this for two or three cycles, you will find that things improve dramatically. First time you do it, your first cycle might seem really quite different. It might be more painful, it might, might be longer, it might be more heavy as it's really working to get everything flushed out. But after that, you will begin to see things like the blood being a better color, the, the blood being a better flow, less clots, less brown blood, less pain. So it's really worth making that investment and very good for just boosting that circulation if you are getting ready for IVF. So the only times that you don't do it is if you've had some sort of surgery and procedure recently, if you've got any infection going on, or if you are pregnant or could be pregnant, or if you are actually bleeding on your period. So I hope that that is useful and that you enjoy your castor oil packing.